welcome back to my YouTube channel. This vlog is a really, really exciting one. Do I have stuff in my teeth? No. This vlog is a very, very exciting one. So we are actually in Manchester today. Um, we came up last night very, very late because when it comes to organization and travel, Aaron and I are just not it. We ended up getting here extremely late. I think in the first hour we had like three wee stops. But that's just being on prep because I genuinely cannot stop weeing. Anyway, we are in Manchester. Sorry if you can hear running water in the background. Aaron's just having a shave because we are in a mega rush. We literally have to leave in 10 minutes. Because today I have my bikini appointment fitting situation. If you are new to the competing world, obviously when we do compete and you show up on show day, you wear a stage bikini, which is very glitz and glam, very out of my comfort zone to be honest. I never really wear stuff I've never really wore anything like it, but it's a really special moment and obviously, you know, it's the performance element, it's the end product of all the hard work that I'm putting in right now. So we're actually in Manchester and I am going to Black Ice Bikinis, I have an appointment at 10am and I'm basically going to go get measured up as I currently am. Obviously at this point I am 10 and a half, almost 10 weeks out, so my body and measurements and stuff is going to change still drastically by the time I do actually come to collect the bikini and step on stage closer to show day. I will end up um, sending over my new measurements and stuff like that. But today is all about going to go and pick the colours, pick the look that I'm after. Um, and I thought I would take you along with me and show you kind of what the experience is like. This is obviously is the first time and the first time I'm doing it and experiencing this. I don't think I'm going to show you the colour that I end up picking. I think I'm gonna keep it a bit of a surprise for show day, just to keep, you know, a little element of surprise, I think. But if you probably know me, you've been following me for a while, you kind of probably already know what kind of color I'm leaning towards. Are we sure? Aaron's here, by the way. So yeah, we have that appointment at 10 a.m. Um, and I'm just gonna take you along with me and show you what the experience is like and what we get up to. I'll try and vlog as much as possible, but one thing I keep saying on this journey is I'm really trying to stay present in each and every experience. Okay. So yeah, Aaron will take the vlog camera. I know the girls at Black Ice as well are like super, super sweet and they love sharing on, you know, athlete socials and everything. So I'm sure they won't mind me taking you guys along. And then afterwards we are heading to EP Jungle Gym, um, which is a gym here in Manchester. It's actually where a few of my friends who live in Manchester train. And I think we're meeting up with Courtney and Jacob and getting a session in with them before we head to Liverpool <laughs> because we're going to watch a football game with Aaron's Please. family. My first ever UK football game by the way. Well I have only in Croatia but And then you're going straight to the best. Yeah we're going to watch Liverpool. Is that your tummy rumbling? <laughs> the main part of this vlog for me is my bikini fitting experience. And also how I'm navigating prep whilst travelling really. Like I'm up north and I have two big Ice boxes full of meal prep, which is giving me anxiety to be honest because I don't want it to go warm. Enough nattering, I need to pack up my stuff, get going, and let's head to my bikini fitting. Aaron has a monster and it's exploded. Never a dull moment. This is a soft scoop here, and then in the measurement section, I'll take where you want the front panel to start. Mm -hmm. Probably advise you to touch lower, um, and then obviously even on both sides. Yeah. So So it's more like what vibes you are bringing for this first show because you can always mix and match a lot if you decide to compete long term. So I just think when I go for like a holiday bikini, I love a bikini with a little dip in the front. I think because I do have quite a short torso, it elongates. It will then elongate it. Yeah, yeah, exactly that. Right, so fabrics next. Easy. I'm sorry, the size the last one, which is very dark. It's side, but it doesn't. Yeah. 
not as much. Right. Now, bear in mind, you've not got implants, and also, you want to keep your boobs relatively close together. So some of these are made for girls with implants, and some of these are made for girls with natural boobs. So these super long ones, I'd probably advise against. Nothing that dangles for PCA to you, bro, is I advise. This is stunning. I really do, because I'm not heavy, but like, on jewellery and glitz and glam, but I guess I have to be if I'm competing in bikini. I'm not a fan of these. these. Okay. So what's going to happen is I'm going to be back and forth in bringing crystal pots over. I'll put them in like a bit of a run here. There's one that's a medium. Like, no, that's fucking England. I don't, don't bother. Yeah, okay. right, guys, that's how. I'll start with the lighter ones and I'll work my way up, okay? You got acrylics? Uh, or gels? Just gels, yeah. She might struggle, Aaron, so you might need to help. Yeah, the little purple into it. So, let's go with the immediate nose. I think from here up is immediate nose. Yeah. Those three. Oh, they're so pretty, but it's just like, I look at them and I visualise them. I think a bit for you, dog. Yeah. yeah. I think I like potentially those two, like majority of them are the little Just little pops of that. Yeah. Okay, so we've picked my base fabrics and then little pops of like this, purpley, bluey red crystal, which threw me a little bit, but I think will look so pretty in some lights. So yeah, so excited. I think this is what we're gonna go for. Just got back to the hotel. My little pre-workout rice pudding because we're gonna head to the gym very shortly, but the bikini's ordered. The colors have been chosen. The crystals have been chosen. The connectors have been chosen, everything. The girls at Black Ice are so nice. It was actually such a professional experience. For someone who's very indecisive, I thought I would it was going to be there for a, a little bit at least, just trying to decide what I want. But I think I kind of knew what I wanted when I went there. And yeah, very happy with what I've chosen. It's very hard to envision what it's going to look like because you just pick the base fabric and then you pick the crystals to go on top, then the connectors, and it's all just things you'd like, but it's hard to see how they're all going to go together. No, I'm sure it's going to be fine and I'm really, really... So excited to see what it's gonna look like. I get my bikini on the 9th of May, she said. So they're gonna make it, I have to submit some final measurements and then they ship it to me because I'm not making another trip up to Manchester just for a half hour of fitting appointment. Yeah, then we get it, but very, very happy. I feel like that is just something like off my shoulders because I was kind of pushing that bikini fitting down the line. And then I realised, oh, I'm 10 weeks out. I'm kind of running out of time to get this sorted. But I'm going to eat this and then we're going to go to EP Jungle. I think Courtney's currently in a hair appointment. So she's going to meet us there just to like brief catch up because then we have to make our way to Manchester. I think you're training with Jacob. Uh, make our way to Liverpool. You're training with Jacob. So I'm just going to lock in. I've got posterior and cardio. Which I don't really feel like I've got the energy for right now, but we'll move. Cue training footage. I think my camera's gonna die. Or I'll film my other camera and insert some more high res clips here. So enjoy.
world before we arrived in Liverpool at our Airbnb. Wrapped up the gym session. It was actually a very, very good workout. I really liked that gym. We trained at EP Jungle Gym in Stockport near Manchester. It was a really good session. Then I did some posing. Courtney came by. She wasn't training because she's still a little bit injured with her back and they had plans. Courtney came by. It was nice to see her. Um, and yeah, then I finished off with some cardio. You had a call, didn't you? Fuck you. What's wrong? The wrong lane. Or you just... That wasn't your fault. That wasn't my fault either. Liverpool's crazy. It's actually... <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. It's, it's a little bit... It's a little bit intense and I'm just glad that I'm not driving, really. Shout out all my Liverpool lovers. All your Liverpool fans. You're going to want me to cut this out because you sound... like a goon right now. Yeah, we're just about to pull up to the Airbnb, meet up with Aaron's family. Not yeah. for me. That's one nil. <laughs> I think we have a table booked for 5pm. But I'm going and sitting there having a crispy Diet Coke. And I'm probably going to eat before we go. So I'm also absolutely starving. But it's absolutely fine. Aaron! <laughs> My camera breaks. I feel like it's the first time going out on a family dinner on prep and just sitting there. I don't think I can be asked to go through the whole bringing my own food and trying to tell the wait waiter or waitress that I've got an allergy. It's just a bit long, isn't it? So, yeah, and then we're going to go and watch, watch the game. The game's at 8 o'clock. Um, and I don't, I don't know what to expect, really. Plenty of that. I might need a nap in the taxi on the way. I'll introduce Aaron, Aaron's brother Kieran. Are they not just doppelgangers? Just checked into our hotel. Don't know how well you can hear me. There's the radio on in the background. Is it a hotel? It's more of like a room in a pub. The right does does the job. Does the job. My meal prep is currently sat in the beer fridge. I have one burger here and then another burger here. We're powering through. I feel like this is the first little prep hurdle. But it's absolutely fine. We're on our way. Off to go get some food. Off to get a crispy diet coke. A little bit nervous to see the stadium. I think it's going to be the first time in my life I'm ever going to feel small. 